the first time my mother taught me how to play baduk. She explained to me how the stones created defense lines. Imagine you're 19. It's cold. You're lost and alone. They do say that a short story, a good short story, is a little bit like magic. It's only truly understood after it has come to pass. Ok, n'oubliez pas, sur le texto que vous nous avez envoyé, ça disait « Nous vous invitons à souper afin de parvenir à une entente cordiale. » Qu'est-ce qu'elle a dit, la petite gauchiste? Ils connaissent leur droit, ça se voit. Ça sert à rien de s'énerver. Ok. Je perds jamais une bataille. Est-ce qu'on peut revenir vers le cordial? Starting to think maybe you didn't exist. <laughs> you little devil, Claire. <laughs> I like this side of you. I don't know if it's gotten into me. <laughs> oh my god. I certainly knew there was a huge chance that something would happen and I would never finish this hike. All of a sudden, bounding towards me is a grizzly. All right, Frederick, let's get to work. Mm -hmm. uh, thanks. Twenty-nine years of vigils and poems and laying flowers has not stopped the killing. We need to do something different. The long game is ending violence against women, not managing it. It's ending it. We don't know how to be activists. Like, we're learning that, right? So it's not like you're bringing in a bunch of activists to do something. It's an interesting journey because you don't, at this stage in your life, you really don't understand or know what you're going to do. Well, hopefully I'm going to um, become a family lawyer who works with survivors of violence. We've got the wherewithal to raise bloody hell. And it is up to all of us to do the work that must be done so that next year when we gather here, 30 years from the Polytechnic tragedy, we can also report on progress. What, are you afraid to be sensitive or something? Are you afraid of anything? Disappointing my parents. Aren't you more afraid of letting go of what you love? I don't know what you expected here when you came, but culturally we're too different. I'm not afraid of anything. 